guys, um, there it is. X Max got the little host lift. All right, this is really good if you want to repair your truck. If you're repairing the truck, I'm trying to set up my light here. All right, so the little lift. I showed you guys how I built this little guy right down here, but the X Max is so big. You're gonna need to set up something down below. You could put a wood. I have a heavy duty box. I painted it, it looks really nice. You could attach screws right through there if you want, if you wanna put on the wood. But anyways, there it is guys. And uh, you could turn this thing around you like, you know, let's take off the body here. And you can maneuver this around all you want. You know, you can work in any angle. You also could put a strap around this. So the truck doesn't fall off right but this is pretty good if you want to do a small small maintenance and if you want to take off the wheels it's right there looking at you guys all right so there we have it guys and if you have any questions please let me know send me a comment all right message me and i will get back to you all right guys so thank you subscribe and bye bye hey guys look what i have for you guys today all right this is from an rc truck you're gonna like this little guy right here, all right? You see my thumbnail? This is what it's on, all right? The X Max is sitting on top of this, all right? We're gonna unbox this, and we're gonna make this right here, right now, guys, together, all right? So this thing is only like 10 bucks, 12, 12 max, all right? You can find it on Amazon. So let's open this little guy up. Oh, this is made by Hobby Parks, Hobby Park, right? And it's just a little lift where the truck sits on and then it twists, turns and you can bring it up and down by turning it. And it lets you repair the truck easily, all right? So pretty much, come as a kit, all right? I'm gonna be using this little table right here. It has a whole bunch of stuff in there, all right? And it has a little, this box, got a magnet, all right? So all the bolts, you nuts and screws you take off your truck, you could attach it right down below, all right? Right, so a little package. This is blue color, right, guys? Blue. And what we're gonna do is I'm gonna take this out of the box and then take it out of the bag. Made a hole in the bag when there was a hole here. But anyways, there's a little scale here to measure. You know, it's like a little ruler right there, all right? So pretty much, it comes with all the pieces, and it comes with the Allen keys and screws. All right, guys, I'm gonna be getting a couple of these. Drop my little Allen keys. There it is. I'm gonna be getting a couple of these because I'm gonna be putting all of my trucks on it. We're gonna make this truck, uh, we're gonna make a little stand for every single truck that I buy, all right? But anyways, this little guy right here, it's adjustable. So you go up about six inches. Right? That's how you do that. Anyway, the truck will be sitting on top of this. So this goes just like that. And one of the screws goes in here. It is. Let me take out my Allen keys, guys. And I'll take my Allen key. I'll spin on the screw right there. Wish I had my power tool by now. That would have been awesome for me to tighten this little guy. Right? So. I'm gonna make it nice and tight because it's not coming apart. If they have the gives me trouble, it becomes loose. I'll put some lock thread on this. So there it is, guys. And next step is it comes with a lot of these little locking mechanism things right here. They go in here, right to the side. If you, they're very tiny, all right. You can always use these to lock up the lift wherever you want it to just stand does not you don't want it to move 
but I'm gonna put this in and I'm not gonna tighten it because I do need this little guy to move around All right for instance if I'm working on taking off the right wheel then I want to move the left wheel I don't want to go around it I'm gonna just twist it alright so the truck can maneuver around there it goes All right guys and Keep it moving guys. In the bottom, you're gonna put the bottom plate. You're gonna take two of the other screws. You're gonna screw those on. One by one we'll do that. Hand tighten it and then we'll tighten it with the Allen key. Okay guys, there it is. So you can't go wrong. One has two holes, the other one has one hole. So you can't put the right one at the wrong place. The right one has to go on its spot. There it is guys, we have that. Okay, with two more little of these locking mechanism tools that they go in here, but maybe that's if you lose it. But other than that, okay. I think uh, they're supposed to go in the there or I don't know what's the case but I'm gonna just stick this in there because I'm not gonna be using it that'd be like a little spare little guy for me in there I'll just stick it in there and I'll thread it all the way in there and then I'll put another one on top of that because it comes with two of these I guess I'll take the second one and I'll put that on the Allen key and I'll attach it in there this would be like a spare thing for me so down the road, if I ever lose one or two, I can always pull those out from right from down below. All right, leave those there. Let's keep it moving, guys. Then it comes with these pads, all right? The pads go on the top of this, all right? And then it has holes in it. But at the meanwhile, I'm not gonna take out the little pieces in the center of this, all right? And all you do is you line, you hold this together, just look at where it goes and then you just drop it down and that's it. Give it a cushion, nice and uh, free play, right? And then these little guys, you can just take these out, you don't need them, right? Throw the garbage, just toss it to the side, guys. And we'll do the same thing with another one for the opposite side. And all you do is you align it. this way all right so don't put it the wrong way guys just align it and drop it and press on it all right push these other guys out bada bing bada boom you're done you want to save these it's up to you but uh, i really don't need it and then this little guy is a magnet you see this this side it has a little ruler marking so i'm not gonna block that so the other side i'll attach it right there in the center right and what you can do is you take your screws whatever you want if you just attach it there they'll stay there right guys there you go there we have our little lift thank you subscribe bye bye if you like this guys buy all right when i put my truck on you will see how it looks like all right i'm gonna take it to the park and put it that way i can take a good picture of it and that's the one you're gonna see as a thumbnail. So if you're watching this video, you already saw it and then you clicked on it. So bye bye guys, peace out. See you on the next one. Check out all of my races guys. We're gonna be doing a hell of a races. You're gonna love our videos. And we can't wait till the snow comes out. We're gonna, we're gonna be slipping, sliding all over the snow, all right guys? 